I've just been a very sad person lately. I just, like, I'm easy, like, now I just, I'm being the person I don't want to be no more. Like, I see the person in my head, I, I know how, like, crazy it sounds, like, I see the person in my head, and I'm like, I'm not that yet. I'm not that yet. And then I'm like, I'm, right now, I'm, I think I'm a disappointment because there are some things that I do and I'm like, damn, bro, you're just making yourself look bad at this point. Like, sometimes I just be having thoughts of like, just things, man. I just move on, just move on and like, I move on, I keep moving on, and I keep enjoying my life, and because there are others out there who can't, because they get it taken away from them early, and shit, they get it taken away from early, either, they either have a choice, or they don't, and this world could be a mix of good and bad. This, this entire first grade of high school, it's not like, oh, it's like, like, tragic or traumatic. It's just been the worst for me, and I've been keeping up with my grades. Just like, it was, I don't even know what i do. I don't know if it was like a revelation or like karma. I just had like the worst year, like the worst, and, and niggas are gonna say, Oh my fucking god, I forgot what I was gonna say. Damn it. Oh, I was gonna say some shit like, oh, other people from other grade levels saying some shit like, oh, it's because you're a freshman. And it's because, like, no, I see other freshmen and they get treated right. And it's like, I'm gonna be honest, sometimes I like, like envy or like jealousy. It's like, honestly, I think. I'm like, why is why are you jealous? For me, I ask this question: Why are you jealous? Like, why? Just why? Like, why do you why do you envy this person? Why are you jealous of this person? And I'm like, this is one time where my friend, even though he was joking, which, in my point of view, kind of hurt, even though it was a joke. But like, even if I tell niggas that, you know, they they don't care. They don't care. But. Wait a you know, but we were joking around, and uh, in PE and gym, and he said some shit like, "I had good grades. Like, this was quarter three. He said some shit like, "Oh, it's gonna like, oh, I'm smarter. I'm ha- more handsome. I'm more. I get more play. but to get more girls. I uh, I'm more popular, more iconic. Even though." Uh, like, I will lie, bro. That shit really hurt me. That shit actually hurt me, bro. It it was a joke, bro. But like, right now I'm not, I'm not good in the head, man. Like I'm, I'm, I'm sometimes good and I'm sometimes, mostly it's bad, bro. Like it's sometimes it's really bad. And he just said that shit, and I'm like, damn, bro. I I really am fucking disappointment am I cause like I'm just looking at myself and I'm just seeing other people do shit and I'm like I congratulate them when inside I'm like why am I not doing shit like that Like, why am I so left behind and other people having a great time in their lives having like oh they're so like oh they're having the best fucking time of their life having like getting this getting, <coughs> getting that and february was the worst it was a black history month and it was also valentine's day i i hate i don't like valentine's day at all i don't i don't care i don't like it and you're gonna say oh it's because this nigga has no girlfriend 
I don't like it at all. I don't like it. Yes, to see people get gifts and shit, get, like, that shit actually makes me mad. Because, like, <laughs> I'm not getting anything. Yeah, could, why should they get anything? That That's the that's the fucked up ment- mentality I had in my head at that point. It's like, I was basically saying that I thought, like, no one cared about me like that. Like, no one was like, damn. At this point. Like damn, bro. I wish I wish I got what he got. I wish I got he got. It was like damn. I wish I could treat a a girl like that. But like, you know, bro. Like, <sighs> I fucking hate school. I just wake up for like disappointment, bro. Just walk into class one time. And I saw one of my, uh, opposers. I saw one of my... Just a dickhead. No, I'm gonna just say that. Just a dickhead. I don't... I don't hate anybody. It's childish. Like, why do you fucking hate somebody so much? Like, it's fucking stupid. Like, okay. Yeah, you're gonna hate them. Yeah, you hate them. But, like, do you really hate hate them? Or do you just hate them? Because, like... You just saying it just because you're bad. But, like, it, it's fine if you hate me, bro. Because it hurts. There, there's, for some reason, there's, like, a lot of people at that school that hate me. And people don't fucking understand. Like, I try to tell them, be like, oh, do you do this? They think it's because it's me. You know what it is? You know what it is? Yeah. Because it is because of me. It's because of how I act, bro. I don't act like them. I act much differently, bro. I don't act like an NPC. That's why they don't like me, bro. It is because of me, bro. They don't want people like me no more, bro. They don't want people like me at all. I don't even add odd. I don't even add strange. Well, a little bit. Sometimes I tweak out. What are you doing joking about it, bro? I don't do none of that shit. I don't do none of that shit, bro. High school right now is the worst. High school right now is the worst, man. And then comment to me. Commenting on me, bro. Comment at me on the littlest things, bro. Like, just talking about me for, like, no reason. Just, like, oh, it, it, it's too warm for that puffer. I have nothing else to wear. Sometimes I don't want people to see my hair because people are judgmental. Yes, I take pe- I take what people say seriously because I don't have tough skin yet, bro. I, I'm not... I'm not... Because, like... I get made fun of everything, bro. Like, see, yeah, I, yeah as in a joke about her... But, like, I, I sometimes get, like, made fun of, like, all the time, bro. Like, I even do anything. I try to I try to explain to my dad. is like, sometimes, like, let's go off topic for a bit. Sometimes I don't even want to, like, come home because, like, because I just don't want to because I don't want to get yelled at. It's like, my dad goes on a whole rant. It's like, oh, I was in poverty. I was this and that. I was like, what about my story, bro? I don't fucking care if you were in the slums and you ate rats, bro. I don't care if you had bags for shoes. We're explaining my story now, nigga. We're explaining my story, how I feel. You're trying to compare you're trying to compare your story to mine, which is fucking rude. I get it, I feel bad, but how dare you? I bet I bet he went to sleep and like I love comparing stories so much. <sighs> Fucking dickhead sometimes. An asshole. It's like, oh, I had childhood trauma. It's like, you don't, you had childhood trauma. It doesn't make you like this all the time. It's not always childhood trauma that's the problem, or trauma in general. It's you. And it's not, it, in general, it, in general. Wake up, bros. Get ready for the bus, only to be bombarded with disappointment. Disappointment, I tell you. Capital D. Disappointment. Disappointment, bro. Now this nigga's laughing so loud. Disappointment. He's laughing because it's true. He's laughing. <laughs> But, 
Anyways, I'm just, I'm just like, I hate 2024. I hate school. Sometimes it just be like, I hate everybody. I hate school. I hate everything. I hate everything sometimes. I hate it. But what can you do about it? Nothing. We live in a world that's decided by our choices. You make the wrong world, you destroy your own world. And maybe others around you. The government that's sitting in their seats right now is not doing very good choices. Banning TikTok instead of dealing with, I don't know, immigrants or something. Legal immigrants. You want to ban TikTok over some dumb shit when you should be figuring out. And you know what's funny? The Senate is filled with old niggas. That's the worst part. And on, the government does nothing about it. Want to know why? Because the United States government does fuck all. Fuck our citizens. Fuck the military. Fuck everybody, bro. Because that's really how it is, bro. The government says, fuck you, niggas, bruh. You. Wait. Hold on. You. That, that's what it is, yeah. The government doesn't truly care about its citizens, bro. Killed a nigga over cancer. The fuck? The government is the real rat. Some, sometimes the government could be good, which is rare, and sometimes it could be bad, which is most most of the time. It it plays. I hope God cracks these crowd clouds, bro. Crowds. Yes, crowds. I hope God cracks these clouds clouds one day, bro. Cracks these clouds. And I know one day the government will get what it deserves. Cuz in life we all get karma. And the government's about to get most of it. All that shady shit the government tried to do back then. It's gonna haunt them. Oh. They play God right in front of us. They play a false God right in front of us. Wanting them to feel protected and safe in a state that is falling apart. The United States is divided. The United States is divided, bro. The Civil War. I saw a movie about the Civil War, which oh, probably could happen, actually. Again, the Civil War could happen again. And this is crazy, bro. United States? More like divided states. One thing I could say to the government is that they could do better. Which probably won't happen, but it probably will. And one thing, bro. If it's united, then you've just broken it into pieces. And now it's divided states. Oh. You've taken everything good about it and you just destroyed it. How did we just go, go from... How did I go from venting to talking about the government, bro? There's no way. No way. Let me explain you to the story of how I lost a friend because I was being an idiot. And how sometimes sorry ain't just going to cut it. And every time I look at him, bro, I just miss that friendship we had. You know, sometimes, man, I just, I come home. 
I, I do work. Sometimes I just... I just cry. Because... Sometimes I, I just don't want to do it anymore. And people are going to make fun of me and say, Oh, you're depressed and that type of shit. No, bro. I, I live in a generation where everything's a joke. And it's so sad because the entirety of Gen Z is a joke. We're literally just walking mistakes, bro. Like, I hate this generation. Yes, every single one of us, bro. I hate Gen Z. I hate boomers. I hate millennials. I hate Gen S. I hate all generations, bro. I don't care what you are. You're a bitch. <laughs> Sometimes that's how I feel, bro. Like, we're just... Every generation is a mistake. Humans are mistakes, bro. God created us for what, bro? To be disappointment? Really? To be a disappointment? Creating a generation for what? To do the same shit we did back then? For what, bro? For what? It's just a repeat. It's revolutionary, bro. We're going back. Instead of going forward. Well, the United States is. The United States is slowly, slowly not evolving, slowly going back. But you know why I would stay in the United States? Because in other continents and states, other races look at black people funny. And sometimes not in a good way. Like, why is their skin so dark? Why is their lips so big? What's wrong with their noses? Why are they so tall? Sometimes it scares them. Sometimes they don't like it. And sometimes they question it. So, I just stay in this uh, shitty-ass continent that's probably going to fall apart in, like, a decade. But, you know, let's, let's hope for that to happen, because I'm ready. I probably won't live long to see it, but I'm just ready. Especially Florida is already falling apart. You got uh, Joe Biden and the other old heads deciding... Basically, our fate. Deciding, uh, let's make uh, gas prices higher. Because, like, why not? It's it's very funny. And. I just. Sometimes I wonder, sometimes it's like, sometimes I just don't want to wake up. Either because I'm tired or just don't want to school, but what I mean by sometimes I just don't want to wake up, sometimes it's, I just, death is scary. What's it taste like? Tastes like death. Death is scary, and I'm, I'm gonna be honest, bro, I talk about, oh, I wanna die, like, sometimes I do, and sometimes I don't, I'm, I don't know if I'm scared of death, bro, I'm, mm -hmm. I don't like where my life is heading right now, bro. Sometimes I just have thoughts be like, wish I could just cut the movie short, bro. Yeah, but like, the friend that I was talking about, basically almost everybody in the group kind of sees him as like, I don't know how to describe it as, like, a role model. I don't, I don't even know how to, like, an iconic figure, I guess. Well, I'm just there. 
I really am just there. I'm the clown of the party, but sometimes I don't want to be. I tried to talk about serious shit and they laugh. They laugh because they thought it was a funny joke. I tried to describe the situation that happened with me and my friend. My best friend. My other longtime best friend. They just laughed in my face, bro. They really just laughed in my face. They're a good friend. They're good friends, but they literally just laughed in my face, bro. They did not care what I had to say. Yes, what I did was wrong, but you don't care what I have to say. They just laughed in my face, bro. They dead ass just laughed in my face, bro. That's why I fucking hate people. Sometimes it's just better off with no friends. That's how it really is, bro. Like, just fuck friends sometimes, bro. Are you laugh in front of my face? Are you fucking kidding me? You really laugh in front of my face. So, what does, like, eight years of friendship mean to you? Because, like, if someone was talking about something serious, I would not laugh, bro. I would not laugh at all. And if it's a coping mechanism for that, it could have stated that. But that shit was not funny at all. It was never funny. And it was never meant to be funny. I realized the situation that happened to him. And I completely agree on his behavior and actions. Even though it was a little bit unnecessary. But I completely agree. What I did was wrong. And then everybody just sees me as some fucking bitch bro. Because you know what? I am a bitch. I am. I want them to believe that. Because I'll be successful in life. And they won't. And every time I talked. They would either make fun of me sometimes. Or just laugh and say. Oh what is he talking about? And I'm like. <sighs> sometimes I just want to skip that period. Because like. It's not worth it. It really isn't. It's not worth it. I hate going the first period and I hate going the second period sometimes. This one time my said friend that got angry at me literally ratted on me and said to so I made a joke about some girl that got into a fight who got dragged to the ground. She didn't say too much bad, she just said blah blah blah, blah like shut your mouth. He told her that oh he's talking bad about you. As a joke, because it's ki hee ha ha Because you know what? Fuck Apits, bro. Fuck that nigga. I want him to die. That's basically how I see... That's basically how I think you see me. Because, oh, if, if I were to die, you wouldn't fucking care. Basically, that's how I think that you think. If I were to die, you wouldn't care. Because I will die soon enough, bro. I will die. <laughs> Not now, but... Speaking into existence, because sometimes I do want to go, bro. Sometimes I think death isn't really that scary, bro. <sighs> am I a broken person? I don't know if I am sometimes. Sometimes I feel like I'm not. Sometimes I feel like I am. I don't think I could put the pieces back together. I really don't. all like scattered into like small pieces of dust particles I try not to be this broken person I try to be like a different person be like be like this all happy all like joking person so everybody sometimes I just want to make people happy and I'm not happy sometimes I just don't even care about my happiness bro and I was about to talk to uh in the video he barely uses them I was about to I was about to talk to a therapist, but we canceled that idea immediately. <laughs> For others out there, man, enjoy your life while you have it. I won't, like, die early, early, but I'll die, like, late, late. Because I don't think, sometimes I think 
I am really meant to be here. I'm not meant to be in this shitty ass universe, bro. Like, sometimes I just wish the sun exploded right now, bro. Cause like, I I really wish the sun exploded right now, bro. Cause like, we we don't we don't need to go through this no more, bro. Like, that shit happened in a billion years. Nah, it happened in two years. Sometimes I'm just <sighs> Sometimes I'm like And like No, cause like, if I add strange bro People say, oh are you autistic Or like, are you like, are you like good Like in like a serious matter But like other people that they know, or just, like, other people in general, they ask, like, are you good? Or, like, they ask, like, like, they, 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 why do I get treated different, bro? Like, why do I get treated differently? And, and if you can say if I'm weird, then, like, why do you say I'm weird, but you've done weird things, and but you've probably been weird before? So, it's not a good excuse. Just say you hate me. I know not everyone can like me, but damn, it seems like everyone is sometimes going against me, bro. It's not about the, oh, the world is going against me. Oh, sometimes it's just... Sometimes... I just would, sometimes I think it's better for me to go. And I, I don't want to die, but mostly I don't want to die, but I want to keep living. But having to like wake up, be made fun of, seeing everybody in love, having a great life, bro. No, bro. Sometimes I wish I was just homeschooled in high school but my parents don't got time for that bro and i understand both of my parents have jobs and shit both of my parents had jobs it used to just be one in the house then three then just two <sighs> one of my friends is going through hell right now I tried to end my life so many times. I just don't have the power to do it. Like, I be like, that's not you. That don't do that. That's not you. And I. I wish life was less harder on me. Because why can I have fun like other people? Uh, one second. Uh... Why do I get the shittiest treatment by other people? Why do I get to be traumatized? Why can't I just be like everybody else? See, and this is why I think this life is not meant for me. I know what's going on in the world. Ukraine, uh, Israel, and Pakistan. I think, or Palestine. Yeah, Palestine. I know what's happening. No, just like, oh, no utopia or no dystopia. Just in between. Less bad things and less good things. Just balanced. Probably more on the good side. Probably a little bit more on the bad side. But so. nothing major.
I'm always paranoid. I don't know what that even... I don't know if it's a good sign or a bad sign, but... I'm always paranoid. Sometimes I just think, am I really happy? Or am I just being deceived? So I guess that's it on the vent. Oh, a few more things. One of my friends told my angry friend about what I said. I didn't even say anything bad, but like, yes, it was talking behind. I wasn't even talking about it, but I was just saying how I felt about the situation. But it sounded like talking behind the back, but it actually wasn't. I told him the angry friend got mad at me. Said some say like, just tell me what you said, and then I told him. Then I just cried, and I should have just took my life right there. Honestly, would have been amazing. But I keep talking about oh, take my life, take my life, take my life. Sometimes I just hate everybody, and. Sometimes, I just want to, like, sometimes I want to leave everybody, bro. Like, just start a new life. Start, make some new friends, bro. Make a new family. Make a new name. Sometimes I just leave everybody, bro. Just leave everybody. Fucking end, fucking ending B. <laughs> ending B. Just leave everybody. Just to start a new life or something. leave all that shit in the past and be like but I won't have the courage to do that and I'll never do that just, just I sometimes just really want to do that just leave everyone and I mean everyone and then just like basically a new life a restart sometimes I just really do want to do that I took a break from Discord because I'm not mentally doing so good right now. I told two groups that. And then I told partially group three, but not all. I need a break. From Discord, from everything. And I don't need no more trauma from Ets. Because the only thing I'm just trying to look at on Ets... It's just fucking guns. And it may be some art. Just guns, bro. I just want to look at fucking firearms. The Second Amendment, bro. I just want to look at that, bro. It's not that fucking hard. So I can get some, like, guns for, our, for my characters that I'm writing. Or maybe, just in general, just to see how it looks. But, anyways. Goodbye. Yeah, sorry for this long ass video.